Bring on the Sopapillas, exciting news for Casa <laughs> Bonita fans, curious diners, and Mexican food enthusiasts alike. Reservations could open to the public this summer. Karen Morfitt is your reporter in Jefferson County and joins us live tonight from the Pink Palace. And Karen, many of us never thought we would see this day. It has been almost a year since Casa Bonita opened in the first place, and people still can't make reservations without that all-important invitation. Right, Kelly, it's kind of a lottery right now. You use your email, you sign up, hope you get an invite to make a reservation. Then if you do, you hope that you can find a time that works for you. Well, as first reported by the Denver Post, the new owners are now flirting with the idea of getting rid of that invite process and Coloradans we spoke with say they're ready. Nearly a year since its grand reopening and Casa Bonita is still a mystery to thousands of Coloradans. I signed up long before they opened. Ken and Kathy Hudson say them. it took nearly that long before they landed the opportunity to make a reservation. All right, you guys excited? The Hubbard family was another looking forward to seeing the new renovations and testing out that new menu. Hopefully the food's much better. All worth the wait for one reason. A mystery. It's, yeah, it's history. You know, we, we were here before at the old Place. Of course, I went here and the rest of my family and my wife uh, since we were kids, and so we're happy that uh, there's new ownership and that they uh, revived it. And for that same reason, visitors say it's time to do away with that invite-only reservation system. I think it's a good thing. I would love to bring my grandchildren, but I didn't want to wait this long to bring them. An idea that owners Matt Stone and Trey Parker are considering. Media representatives for the restaurant confirm there's potential to see those changes by the end of the summer. It was uh, good marketing in the beginning. New people need to experience it. Now, the discussion around those changes to the reservation process come as a new film documenting the massive renovation and expensive renovation project here at Casa Bonita is set to debut at the Tribeca Film Festival later this week. We're live tonight in Lakewood. Karen Morfitt covering Colorado first. Yeah, there's a lot of people who are anxious to get inside there. I know you're one of them. I was going to say, you are <laughs> <Me> too. too. <laughs> Karen, thank you. Well, Karen is your reporter and neighbor in Jeffco. She's excited about getting into Casa Bonita as well. She lives in that community with her husband and her kids. If you have a story idea for her or any of your reporters here at CBS Colorado, just visit our website and send them an email.